What up, 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 what up? It's your boy, Baby Zarus, and we back with another video. Today, we playing Contraband Police, the demo. Now, this is a demo, so it's in the testing phases right now, so the gameplay might be a little bit, uh, you know, out of whack sometime. Like, I was experiencing some lag, um, some crazy lag during gameplay playing this game towards the end. And that's one of the reasons why I ended the review kind of early. But, um, yeah, it's a brand new game. Um, it's a demo in the demo phases right now. So I got some bugs, some kinks they got to work out. But overall, it's a pretty cool game. Um, you work as a, like a border patrol agent. And you have to, like, people are trying to cross over. And you have to be, like, very on top of things in this game. You know, um... You get to search people cars, you know, you got to find different defects in the cars, defects in the tires, bumpers, different things. You know, you got like a little checklist guide you got to go through, make sure everything is right with the car. Like, not everything got to be perfect, but you definitely got to mark the damage and different things like that. If they got a flat tire, you got to mark the flat tire, you got to mark the body damage, you got to mark any interior damage you might see, anything that might be out of place that, you know, maybe they're smuggling some drugs in or maybe they're trying to hide some guns or anything you know contraband you know so your job is like any other border patrol agent is to make sure that nobody is bringing drugs out of the country into the country you no know, weapons none of that stuff so that's basically the gist of the game it's supposed to be more involved to it i haven't gotten there that far yet but you know i just wanted to make a quick little video so you guys could uh you know see some gameplay if you haven't had a chance to play the game or if you don't even know the game exists you know, so I'm just basically just giving a quick little rundown of the game so far, what I learned from the game. Um, you know, I missed out on a few little uh, tasks when I was checking checking the cars and stuff. I was overlooking some things. You know, I felt like I was like, geez, I'm taking mad long. Like, you know, but this game, you have to be thorough. So that's one of the mistakes I made. I was kind of, you know, somewhat rushing just to see, like, what else they were going to tell me. You know, just trying to f learn some stuff real quick. Like... So I was trying to get through the car just to get an idea of the game so they could tell me, but I really should have been doing what they asked me. It would have been a way better experience probably, you know. And But then again, like I said, it did start lagging on me, so that kind of made me um, stop the feed a little bit early. But other than that, it's a pretty cool game. As you can see, it has a lot of different buttons for different things. Um, this is our like little uh, log book. And it got a handbook inside, and it tells you different things you're supposed to look for, different things for the checklist that you're supposed to check out on a person's car, on a person, you know, things to look out for. Um, basically, it just gives you a rundown of things you want to check for, like as a Border Patrol agent, the things that you will be on the lookout for, things that may um, come across a little bit suspicious or whatnot. But, yeah, I feel like it's a very, very, very informative game. At the same time, it's like, this is like some real life stuff, like, people really do this job every day, like, and they made it into a game where you get to step in their shoes for a little bit, even though it ain't gonna really do it no justice, but, you know, you get a kind of idea of what to expect if you were, like, a Border Patrol agent, basically, or whatever they're called, you know, but it's, it's pretty cool, like I said, it's a fun game, um, it's a learning curve, it's a lot of buttons, a lot of different things you could do, definitely strategic you gotta pay attention you gotta be very very uh what's that called um i already said precise but there's another word i was looking for but you gotta be very very on top of things in this game um i enjoyed it really you know but for right now with the little bugs and kinks i'll have to give it a seven for right now but i know once it comes out and i really get to play it and i heard you can find like guns purchase guns different type of weapons i believe you could get food and you know you do little side missions and whatnot so there's a lot involved with the game like it's just not you just there searching cars all day it's a whole bunch of different things like you could take bribes but you got to be careful like you know you got to just watch yourself you could take bribes but you probably don't want to get caught by like one of your fellow agents or something you probably get ratted out lose your job or money or something like that you know you lose money in this game and you get money in this game when you search cars thoroughly you know you get 
money per everything you got right on the list but then if you get things wrong you also lose money so like i said it's a pretty cool game you get to check the weight of the car you got to really be on top of things like you even weigh the car make sure they driving the right car make sure they got the right license plate like you see this car you got the damage uh quarter panel have to write that down any little thing even if you don't think it is 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 good enough to write down it is it's very sensitive very thorough with this game like you have to really be on top of everything like any little thing that's out of place you have to report it like so this is like serious business it's almost like our prison sim we played but i kind of find this one i mean it's it's like smaller area so far from what i've seen but i opened the map it was kind of huge so i know it has a lot to offer you know it's kind of like our prison simulator prison simulator was fun getting a beat up inmates and getting jumped and whatnot so I'm definitely looking forward, I don't know if it's the same makers of that game in this game, but I'm definitely looking forward to more from them. You know, they're coming out with this simulator, I wonder what they're going to do next. A, a daycare simulator, where you get to house crying babies and chase around bad little kids. They need to come out with a real drag racing simulator. Guys, if y'all guys watching this video, you, you got all this good software you guys use because the game looks great. Imagine making like a nice little drag racing game, even if it got like some knockoff cars, like you know, some cheap wannabe Camaros or something like that, called the Shamero or something. You know, just make something you make it some interesting games. But I want to see you guys expand to like different genres. Yeah, basically, it's all around the same kind of thing, like being an officer but it's all like realistic stuff that's what i could give y'all props for because it's like super duper realistic like as far as things you have to do like the jobs like inspect the cars do this do that like it's actual things you will have to really look for if you had this job so i give y'all props on that like y'all very thorough with that and if a real border patrol agent probably had this same handbook he'd probably be successful too reading that handbook from the game because that handbook is pretty sick man so if you guys haven't played it it's in like i said it's in demo phase which is you know kind of like beta or whatever i would say if you haven't played it go give it a try you know play longer than i did you know tell me what's up yeah i might be getting back on it soon um i had came across it on like a facebook ad or something and i clicked it and it said it was free on steam so i was just like you know what let me grab it review it so if any guys are interested in these type of games, you know where to get them. Check them out on Steam. I get a lot of my games from Steam. I have a lot of different games. Um, yeah, and that's about it. Um, if you like the video, please leave me a like. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I definitely appreciate it. I appreciate all my subscribers. We came from 50 something subscribers, what, like two weeks ago. Now we're almost 400 subscribers strong. So we're making progress, man. I definitely want to get you guys more involved into everything I do. So if you have any ideas, any games you guys want me to review, or if you want me to keep playing this game or keep playing any other games that I play, just let me know. You know, this is a team effort. You know, you guys give me some ideas and I execute them to the best of my abilities know so with that being said guys i love y'all i appreciate y'all hope y'all have a good evening and like i said if you haven't liked the video like it please if you haven't subscribed please subscribe and uh you know i hope you enjoyed the video but i'm gonna let it play through the rest you guys keep being amazing and i'll keep doing my best for y'all i appreciate it later guys babies out
Ať vracho nažik. Pak má tůroch. 